Preparing for take-home exams. Strategies for managing your time and prioritizing your work take-home exams are becoming increasingly common as a form of assessment in universities and colleges. Unlike traditional in-class exams, take-home exams provide students with more time to complete their work and allow for a greater depth of analysis and research. However, this does not mean that they are any less challenging than in-class exams. In fact, they require a different set of skills and strategies to ensure that you can manage your time effectively and prioritize your work in order to produce the best results. In this article, we will provide you with a range of strategies that you can use to prepare for take-home exams. These strategies will help you to manage your time effectively, prioritize your work and produce high-quality work that will impress your professors. Plan your time carefully One of the most important things that you need to do when preparing for take-home exams is to plan your time carefully. Unlike in-class exams, you have a longer period of time to complete your work, which means that you need to break down the work into smaller tasks and set deadlines for each task. This will help you to stay on track and ensure that you complete your work on time. Create a study schedule In addition to planning your time carefully, you should also create a study schedule. This should include the dates and times that you will work on your take-home exam, as well as the tasks that you need to complete during each study session. By creating a study schedule, you will be able to manage your time more effectively and ensure that you make progress towards completing your work. Set realistic goals It is important to set realistic goals when preparing for take-home exams. This means that you need to be honest with yourself about how much time and effort you can realistically commit to the exam. Setting unrealistic goals will only lead to frustration and disappointment. Instead, set achievable goals that will allow you to make progress towards completing your work. Prioritize your work When working on a take-home exam, it is important to prioritize your work. This means that you should focus on the tasks that are most important and that will have the greatest impact on your final grade. For example, if your exam is worth 50% of your final grade, you should prioritize the tasks that will help you to achieve a high score on the exam. Break down large tasks If you are faced with a large task, such as writing an essay, it can be overwhelming. However, by breaking down the task into smaller, more manageable tasks, you can make the task more achievable. For example, you could break down the essay into sections, such as the introduction, body paragraphs, and conclusion, and set deadlines for completing each section. Use a timer Using a timer can be a great way to manage your time when working on a take-home exam. Set a timer for each task that you need to complete and work on that task until the timer goes off. This will help you to stay focused and ensure that you make progress towards completing your work. Eliminate distractions When working on a take-home exam, it is important to eliminate distractions. This means that you should turn off your phone, close your email, and avoid social media. By eliminating distractions, you will be able to focus on your work and make progress towards completing your tasks. Take breaks Taking breaks is important when working on a take-home exam. It is important to give your brain a rest and recharge your energy levels. Take a short break every hour or so and do something that you enjoy, such as going for a walk, listening to music, or reading a book. Use online resources There are many online resources that can help you prepare for take-home exams. For example, there are study guides, practice exams, and online forums where you can ask questions and get help from other students. Take Advent. Age of these resources to help you prepare for your exam. Use the marking scheme. Make sure that you understand the marking scheme for your take-home exam. This will help you to understand what your professor is looking for and what you need to do in order to achieve a high grade. Use the marking scheme as a guide when planning your work and when reviewing your work before submission. Seek help if needed. If you are struggling with your take-home exam, don't be afraid to seek help. You can speak to your professor or TA for guidance, or you can seek help from a tutor or academic support center. Remember, it's better to seek help early on than to struggle on your own and risk getting a low grade. Review your work before submitting your take-home exam. Make sure that you review your work carefully. Check for spelling and grammar errors. Ensure that your work is well organized and easy to read, and make sure that you have answered all of the questions fully. Taking the time to review your work can make the difference between a good grade and a great grade. Submit on time Make sure that you submit your take-home exam on time. Late submissions can result in penalties, which can affect your final grade. Plan your time carefully so that you can complete your work well before the deadline and have time to review your work before submission. In conclusion, preparing for take-home exams requires careful planning, effective time management, and prioritization of tasks. 
By following the strategies outlined in this article, you can improve your chances of achieving a high grade on your take-home exam. Remember, it's important to set realistic goals, eliminate distractions, take breaks, seek help if needed, and submit your work on time. Good luck.